I'm so glad you're here with me today. I'm going to be talking about um, an instrument that was invented in 1881 by a guy named Zimmerman, and he called it an auto harp. Most of the instruments that are from Americana 100 years ago were instruments that were made to be easier versions of a more difficult instrument, and this was an automatic harp or an auto harp. And this particular um, brand is a, is a chroma harp, um, which is the rhythm band incorporated. Uh, Oscar Schmidt makes lovely auto harps and other instruments, but I'm going to demonstrate how this would work. So on a harp, you have to find which, which um, tones you want to play. On this, you've got 36 strings. And unless you want to do a spooky night when the wind is coming up through the trees, all you have to do is push a, push a button automatically, and instead of this, you get this. So underneath, there are felts that are cut in particular ways so that only the notes that are in that particular chord are going to come through. And this one has two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 15 buttons on it, and you can get auto harps that have up to 21 um, buttons on them. So it's easy for a child to play because they could just go um, singing like they would with a harp or a piano or a guitar or you can pick it up off your lap and you can start um, playing the chords that have particular notes in it and you can play a um, some of the things that you can do with an auto harp and I'm going to play a song that was written by a Canadian musician in in the 70, 1970s and his name is Frank Mills and this was a very well-known tune down, back in the 1970s and it's called Music Box Dancer. and add a little bit more accompaniment to that same simple melody and come up with something like this. Mm -hmm. 